for to subscribe, like the video, for like it, and share it to a friend think might need it. This video is created by someone in the comments, so if you have something you like me to do, put it down in the comments and I'll check it out. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. So, we're gonna need capo on the second fret. The first thing you're gonna wanna play is 6th string 3rd fret and 5th string 2nd fret. And this is for the, in for the intro. So, you're gonna play the 6th string, and 5th string, and then 6th string, and then 5th string, and then 6th string one more time, and then 5th string. And then you're gonna play 6th string one more time, and then 5th string 3rd fret. And then you're gonna play the 6th string open, and then 6th string 3rd fret, and then 6th string open, and then 6th string 3rd fret, and then 6th string open one more time, 6th string 3rd fret, and then 6th string open one more time, and then 6th string 3rd fret. So this is how the intro sounds like all together. And then go on to the verse. So the verse is pretty much the same as the intro, but you're repeating it four times. So one, two, three, four, and then go to the pre chorus. The pre chorus is pretty much the same as the verse, so. Third time, fourth time, and then go to the chorus. For the chorus, you're going to be playing from C to G, and then D, and then E minor. For the C chord, it's going to be fifth string, third fret, fourth string, second fret, third string open, second string, first fret, and first string open. To play a G chord, it's going to be sixth string, third fret, fifth string, second fret, fourth string open, third string open. 2nd string 3rd fret and 1st string 3rd fret and then to play D chord is going to be 4th string open, 3rd string 2nd fret, 2nd string 3rd fret and 1st string 2nd fret and then to play an E minor chord is going to be 6th string open, 5th string 2nd fret, 4th string 2nd fret, 3rd string open, 2nd string open and 1st string open and the shine pattern is going to be down, down, up, down, up and you're going to repeat that twice, so down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up so that's the shine pattern for each chord so for the chord it's going to be going from C, G, uh, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, D, uh, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, E minor, down, down, up, down, up, one more time, C, then G. But then when you're repeating it, after you're done with the G chord, you're gonna be playing the D chord, but two more times, or two times. So down, down, up, down, up, and then repeat it one more time. So down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, and then go on to the verse so the bridge is from G to D and then C and then E minor so you're gonna be playing that whole thing three times in general and you're playing the strumming pattern that you play for the chorus so second time And then on the third time on the E minor chord, you're just gonna strum once and then go into the chorus. But then for the last chorus, you're gonna be playing from C to G and then D and then E minor. And you're gonna be playing that whole thing four times in general and then. And you're going to be playing the showing pattern that you've been playing in the previous chorus and the bridge. So. Second time. Third time. Fourth time. The E minor, you're just gonna, you're just gonna show it once. So, this is how the whole song sounds like together.
video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to see more videos like this, share to a friend, think might need it, leave a comment down below on what you like to see next, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, see you next time.